Evening everyone, my name is Nicholas from Part-Time Thrifter. I buy this online and I'm zooming for profit. So as we said, okay, uh, I'm going to make sure that I show to you what I do uh, day in and day out really. So even if it's two sales at a time, I'm going to start selling them. I keep finding Forza Horizons on the floor in this, um, <laughs> in this garage, so that's not good. Uh, last time I found one in the bin, so I don't know, I need to actually be more careful with them. Uh, so we've got two sales. First of all, we've got this uh, Star Wars uh, limited edition carbonized unfortunately i bought this initially to sell on amazon uh, but uh, the ranking was way too small so i am going to i've sent it in uh, on ebay and it did sell which is brilliant so i'm just going to use some avoid fill if it doesn't move around And that should be perfect for this item because it's flat. Perfect, you can actually see. And it will go through with track 48. There we go. We just need this guy. First day back, I work today. Wasn't a bad day. Wasn't a bad day. Uh, it seems it seems more relaxed than the last beginning, the last half term. Okay, so obviously I think people are more relaxed with uh, the whole COVID business. So yeah, better. Right. Let's see how much this weighs. This weighs 20, 200 grams even, 200 grams. By the way, if, uh, a lot of people have actually been messaging me on Instagram in regards to um, my reselling kit, so even if it's this this tape gun or the weight scale, so I've put it below in the link in the description for you guys. Now, unfortunately, what we've got here is we've got uh, one of these is actually sold too. So I'll take this guy out of here. So he's gone uh, for twenty four ninety nine, if I remember correctly. Again, uh, a decent sale through the global shipping program, especially when we paid nine ninety nine. So obviously the new movie is out. This is why they're actually selling. Um, I'm happy they're selling because I thought I was going to stay with Kong forever, but I've only got one. I'm not over exaggerating, I think potentially at some point I actually had bought 20 of these warbats and I'm left now to the last three. So definitely a really good buy, definitely a really good buy. Uh, I'm some void fill for this. I'm trying to use, start using the void fill more the bubble wrap because I have got so much void fill, it's ridiculous in this garage. I've literally got three big Royal Mail bags of void fill. Oh, so that's good. And I'll just put my well put one more this way. So I need to change Optimus Words of Wisdoms also. Not point five, not point five. Edgy. That's brilliant. Uh, so that's the two shells I've had today. Um, it's been a really good day on Amazon. I'll show you what my Amazon looks like. Uh, so Amazon, I'll take a screenshot actually. I can show that in fact. Yeah, so 293. Yeah, so quite a decent month. I'll take a screenshot now so I can show you there too. Um, which is not a bad one. And we've also got selling i think we've got a bid yeah so 10 pound 50 so that's actually a really good so had loads of freebies from uh lego yeah so lots of freebies from lego i've listed them all together in fact i've actually already packed that uh and it's got 16 minutes it's gone 10 pound 50 plus postage so that's brilliant that's 10 quid from literally nothing for us uh so i'm pleased with that 
But yeah, that's day one. This is day two for this video, and I'm just showing you uh, the Amazon sale that I've got and the eBay sales also. So first of all, we've got this Ted Baker set that we bought for six pound fifty, and that's been sold on Amazon for uh, eighteen quid. I did want to initially. I bought quite a few of them, and I wanted them to sell them into Amazon, but. It seems that because it's got spray, um, it cannot be sent through UPS. So I need to find out how to do that. But until I'd find out how to do that, I thought, well, may as well see if you can sell it sort of a time. Um, and it did. It sold quite fast, really. It sold within the week. So I'm pleased with this. It's going to go in a nice little box. Perfect. And all we've got to do is seal it up. And that weighs 0 0.8 kg. Baker will leave it there for us. That's the first one gone. Next one we've actually got is I'll sell, I'll show you this baby Infantino. We bought it for seven quid and it's all for 20. Brilliant, nice, easy, easy money. And I'm just reusing other boxes and finally, finally, finally getting to the bottom of my boxes. Stick that in here. Uh, a void fill is what we need, so we'll go to the magic bag of void. I did say I had three of these, and now I have two of these Royal Mail bags full of void fill. Let's just say the last few Amazon parcels have had. An enormous amount of void fill. I don't want to bin it, I want it at least being used for something else. I knew that was going to happen. Back to using eBay tape. You can tell, you can tell the difference in quality already, guys. I'm not even joking. Right, so this weighs um, 1.3 kg. And I'm just putting Infantino on it too, so you remember what it is. So that's gone. Um, really, really nice sale. 64.50, we got this for free from Lego. All I'm doing is making sure that I'm getting rid of the marks because he has been in the garage unfortunately. So getting rid of all the dust marks really from it. Uh, so bubble wrap. Nice set that is actually. I still need to actually varnish this table. Um, really nice. Basically it's just a wallet. Um, initially that was selling for 80 quid, but I thought I was going to be clever enough and I think there is a video where I could have potentially have sold this um, with a Lego set for 249 That Lego set guys did not move. Uh, it actually did move eventually, uh, but on Amazon. And um, hence I got left with this, I'm thinking let's sell it, 64 quid, amazing. We need to find a nice box for this. So, leave it on one side and we'll find a box. Continuing on, Mandalorian, 75 quid from 50. Brilliant. Uh, happy with this. I have got about 15 of that Mandalorian set. So, I'm happy for it to go. Get some traffic on my account. 
I do think Christmas time this will be selling for a hundred quid. Yeah. Uh, it's perfectly in this bag. In this box even, not bag. Yeah, there's no resistance whatsoever in this tape compared to the other one. Wow, that's crazy. So I'm definitely going to be buying the other clear tape again. By the way, uh, all the reselling kit that I've actually, whatever I'm using, um, I finally actually took the time to make the reselling kit look pretty. So all you've got to do is go in the description and you'll be able to find it at Lego. So that's going to. And uh, continuing on, we've actually got another one of these bad boys. A Warback figure for $25.99. Really happy, another sale really uh, for this good. It's probably been the best good I've actually bought um, this year, I would say, because it just keeps selling and selling and selling. So we're going to stick it in, and what we're going to do is we're going to chuck loads of void fill in here so it doesn't move. We're gonna cut the box. The box has already got, uh, it's already been pre-scored. So when I cut these, it should be able to actually fold up nicely. So nicely here. And all I have to do, oh, how bad is this tape? Guys, I cannot even compare. Oh, kite packaging, I've never had one before. Right. Uh, how bad this this eBay tape is compared to the other one, the clear one I was using. There's no resistance at all. I don't know, maybe because I've had it in the garage for so long, maybe that'll be the case. Might be the case, but I hadn't noticed it before, how bad it was. And what about weighs? Not 0.5, not 0.8, it must be the heavier box. Not 0.8 kg for Warbat. And that means we are left with three <laughs> uh, figures only from, what was it, even seven we had last week? Not too bad, really for us. And yeah, let's, let's figure it out if I can actually find a little box for this quickly. Right, so we finally found a decent sized box for it. And I mean, clearly it's protected with the bubble wrap already, but we're still want it to be safe. So nice and flat and then all we've got to do is we're going to score it this is actually something that people use for leather um, but that's the only thing I could actually find similar to what Lonnie's got in America with the scoring one, but obviously I didn't want to pay the 20 quid to get it all the way from America. And folds in nicely. Nice, small parcel size now. Not 0.7 kg. Not 0.7 kg. What was that, guys? That was Porsche. Porsche. So, uh, happy with that. 
it's all been packed. Uh, it is day two, hopefully. We should have one more day in here, guys, before I actually complete the video for all use. Uh, so now what I'm going to be doing is I'm simply going to unbox, well, first of all I'm going to flop my hair on one side because it's atrocious and I'm going to unbox all my deliveries for the members only, yeah, so they can actually have a look what I've actually got and what they could be sending into Amazon. But thanks for now. Right guys, it's day three here. Uh, we've got a few sales, like three sales really to actually show you. One of them was actually uh, a Kong figure that I actually sold midweek. Uh, for twenty four ninety nine, so that's already been posted, and we've got two more things. Uh, also, uh, one thousand three hundred ninety seven, so close to one thousand one hundred, which is absolutely amazing. Uh, we've got two sales. So first of all, is Chase Darren. Uh, this is a back gun figure that I actually he gave us a heads up on this, and that's actually gone for uh, I want to say twenty four or twenty two ninety nine. So quite sure for that. So that's just going to go. In one of these boxes that I received. Uh, I think I might need to actually trim it just a bit more uh, if I get my little tool. There we go, that should work. Uh, just to score it just a bit higher up. It means the car will be easier to actually go over on that stage. There we go, box nice secure. That ways. So you guys, I'll put the the scales on the other side here. So if you give me one minute, I'll just quick. And that ways. Not point three kg actually. Not point three. Yeah, I've just put the scale away just to get a bit more space. Next weekend, I'm gonna make sure that I vanish this table. So, because um, there's still a lot of dust that goes off it. So. That's only just the one I'm going to run is that. And then the other thing we've actually got is a brand new Lego set um, for $59.99. Happy with that. It's gone. Um, yeah. Nothing nothing special about it. I bought it for 42 quid and I sold it for $59.99. So nothing extremely special about this Lego set, really. Uh, could I put some void fill to stop it moving around? It's up here. Yeah, so you should be seeing this today, Sunday, uh, and hopefully it should be three days worth of sales and uh, hopefully more than just five items. And that weighs 0.9 kg for anyone who's interested. 0.9 kg. So I'm going to post these two. Uh, they're going away tomorrow, and I've got a massive FBA shipment um, to actually do. But yeah, looking forward, it's, uh, it's quite nice, I've now got like five members in a group, so again I'm going to make sure that we do like a monthly um, monthly live and also during the week make sure that when I unbox any goods that I actually get, uh, I show them exactly what I'm actually getting. But that's been now for now, uh, hopefully you had a nice weekend, hopefully you enjoyed the sun and as always, keep thrifting.